Yo guys and girls, so today this is a bit of a different video But I just came back from the cinema And I watched um, a new a new film called The Women's King um, It's a fantastic film And it's basically about um, a true story It was This this film was set in 1820 um, And it focused on um, like how like discrimination and diversity I I thought it was a fantastic film, it's brilliant. Yeah. I re I thoroughly really enjoyed it. My review would be uh twenty six out of twenty six, that's how good it was. Um and also there was quite a lot of people which you, a lot of people would notice in there. John Baega was in there, um a couple of other people. So yeah, um and I absolutely love it. It's quite a different film to uh, a lot of others, which I think is good. Um, definitely more probably tear filled edge of your seat film. So like he's on the edge of your seat sometimes. Definitely more um emotional because there's quite a lot of violence in it. So it's fifteen um it's rated fifteen and over. So any people under fifteen do not take him there because it's got violence in there, um so it's got gore in there, it's got Quite a lot of stuff which is not suitable for people under 15 or over. Um, so yeah, and I recommend go going to watch it if you are either 15 or over 15. So I'm 17, so that's why I could watch it. Um, I thought, like I said, I thought it's fantastic and I would highly recommend watching it. Um, and it's a very important film too because it shows how, um, how much discrimination was... Um, there years ago, and it's a very good film. Um, and it also shows how, like, like I said, how many discrimination it was and diversity. But now it's you know this time. Um, you know we were doing quite a good job of discrimination. So we we're doing quite a good job of keeping it low. Obviously, there's some people which. Uh, would still discriminate against people, but it's, you know, it's not good at all. But years ago, people thought it was fine to discriminate against people of different colour, different sexuality, different gender. Um, and this film represents what it was like years ago, like a lot of stuff in there you would not believe happened um, years ago or would hopefully not happen now. So yeah, it's a fantastic film, like I said. Um, it's Africa-based, so the film, I think, was shot in Africa. Um, and it has, like, a bunch of African people as, like, the main characters. So the people which are in there are all, like, um, Africans or, like, people of colour. Which I think is fantastic, it's fantastic more a representation of different, um, you know, like... Races and diversity groups. Um, so yeah, and they had a lot of good actors in there and actresses, obviously. Um, and I would say a big, massive well done to everyone involved with that film. Um, and I absolutely loved it, like I said already. So yeah, my review, like I said, is a 26 out of 26 rating. Um, if you do go and see it, let me know. And if you've already seen it, let me know and tell me how much you've enjoyed it. I actually loved it. Like I said a bunch of times. Um, but it's, I would say it's worth a watch. Definitely worth watching. It's different to other films, but I would say good different. Um, and like I said, it has you on the edge of your seat in some scenes. Or some scenes actually like crying or very emotional. And other scenes, it's kind of as you scared. So it's kind of like, so it's got like a bunch of different um, genres in there, in that film. So if there's a bit of horror in there. Well, not horror, but there's a bit, bit of like um, scary stuff in there, like blood and other stuff like that. Um, but it focuses on what it's like years ago, um, just being a black person or just being... Like the colour you are, because years ago you were not accepted, but today you, I hope you, like a lot of people, are accepted. But still, we still got some problems with racism and stuff like that. And now, 
But um, this video is not supposed to be a political one. It's just me reviewing uh, the women's um, the women's king. So yeah, it's, it's a fantastic film, and I would definitely say worth a watch. And it's quite a long film, but it's definitely worth it. And it's also based on a true story, so um, that's even better. I I wouldn't say better, but it's good that it's based on a true story. It's not just all of it. It's not just fi fiction. Um. But yeah, and I cannot believe, with some of the stuff I saw in this film, I cannot believe that happened years ago. Some of the stuff is just outrageous. Um, but yeah, and not, I'm not going to spoil any of this film, but it's fantastic. Definitely worth a watch, like I've already said a couple of times. Um, and it's very unique, the way like who was protecting the kingdom and stuff, because there's like a kingdom in it and stuff, but who was protecting it was very cool. Um, so yeah, okay, this is where I'm going to be saying goodbye, and I'll see you later for another video, possibly, okay, bye-bye.